Hey guys, Andy here, just to show you quickly an app that Google has released, uh, I think just today. Um, it is called, if I can find it, uh, Photo Scan. So we're going to say scan more photos. Cause I've, <laughs> I've actually done this photo once, but I'm going to do it again for the purposes of now, can you see that's on my screen? I've got the photo roughly lined up. Let's take flash off. Got plenty of lights already. I take the picture. You see there's four dots have appeared on my phone screen. So I go over each dot. A little weird. It spins around, but it doesn't actually complete the circle until, well, I'm not sure what. So you see, I was, at, I was turning my phone a little bit on all sorts there. It was not like it was perfectly lined up. But it produces this. Now we can adjust the corners. So you see there, when I hold down on it, you see up in the top there? So you can get quite a precise, oh, yeah, quite a precise slide into each of the corners. Like so, hit done, and there's my duplication of my photo. Save all. You can then, as I say, I've done it once before, so you see, it. oh, yeah, you see it's there twice. Um, but that's it. Now, it's not the greatest of duplications. It looks like it's a kind of a, it looks almost a little low res and like there's not been that many different colors. It's a little grainy, I suppose, basically. So it's not perfect. That may improve in time. I don't know. Um, I don't think it's an issue with the photo. Oh, there's a hair on. Did, I, did it get the hair? No, I think it, it took the hair out even, perhaps. Or maybe the hair wasn't there. Anyway, whatever. Uh, but yeah, just to me, it seems a really clever app to get you a copy of a, you know, ideally an old photo. I probably got this on a JPEG somewhere, but um, it will get you a, a you know, you, you can make copies of old family photos and all sorts in in no time really and transfer them onto onto your Google Photos. So there you go, it's photo scan, fully enough, not actually compatible with my Pixel XL. So I had to download it from APK Mirror. Uh, but by the time you're watching this video maybe it's a bit a little bit more readily available. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. My name's Andy. I'll catch you all again soon.